Addressing the media in Kumasi, President of the Association, John Akwesiam Ponsa, said the recent macroeconomic indicators, such as high inflation, interest rate, and import duty charges, has compelled them to increase the price. Ghanaians want to produce high quality books. As a result, when we produce the books internally, copyrighted in our own names, we take these books abroad to get them printed. Once they are printed, we bring them back to the country, take advantage of the Florence Agreement in 1950 to lower the cost of sales so that education will be free and affordable to all Ghanaians. If you go to the port today to clear 140 feet container, something that is already stated to us that no port duties because of Florence Agreement, you will end up paying about 290,000 Ghana cities. But how are sellers of textbooks receiving this? The new team visited some bookshops at Kewo to find out. So on two on two books no more dia and 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 books no need to be a form because it's a man in one in scan you so I buy it here here you know I buy my my better energy man boom is be you buy for me now here me tell you as much as my baby juma so you say any man eh eh here you dia and eh and can be be boy but the most now we here you dia eh moi and you know I buy no eh the on show no any name my my if you are kunedu is already struggling. To afford the cost of books for her three children. For her, any increment will come as a huge burden on her finances. Once the authors and publishers are thinking about increasing the cost to save their business, the sellers also fear that any increment is likely to affect patronage and they want government to intervene. But in all this, parents will be the ones to bear the brunt of the increment. Ibrahim Abubakar, TV3 News, Kumasi.